we get to a lightweight bout between Conor McGregor and Dustin Poirier. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Both fighters 29 years of age. McGregor will have a two-inch reach advantage. All right, we send it back. Here we go, first one, you ready? Are you ready? Let's well, go! the United Kingdom boasts some of the most passionate MMA fans in the world, and they have packed the nines tonight. Good to have you with us as we get underway here at the O2 Arena in London, England. Nice. Just out of range with the straight left hand. He's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by McGregor. Well, he's connecting with his punches now. Took him a while to find the range. He has found it now. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by McGregor. They have started this fight off with a brawl. He missed with that jab attempt there. So unguarded right into the pocket, and as such, he leans right into that uppercut, left the head wide open, and I'm not sure how many more of those, Joe, he's gonna be able to take. Let's see if he gets the hands up, tries to circle out, and get that head off the center line. And he lands a nice kick. And a left hand behind him. Fainting. Really missed with that right hand. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Poirier. And another kick. The shot is blocked there. Oh, he, he got a clip there. He got a Connor with a beautiful combination. He's got him hurt here. Oh! Oh, nice punch there by Dustin Poirier. Oh, McGregor's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. And here we see it again. Crank right on the jaw. Bruce Buffer has your decision. 